Yo, we are back with another Pico Calc video. We have turned the Pico Calc into a synth. Can you believe it? I can hardly believe it. But it is indeed a synth. P to stop. Yes, we do have it running through the Digitac and through a guitar pedal to make it work. But hey, it's still, it still made it. It still made it. So, I'll do a little bit of a demo first. We'll press P again to play. We can go up an octave, or two, or three. We can change our note if we go to the right. Let's come on back down. We can change our wave with W. Again. And again. And granted, we do have a little LFO on our analog heat FX, but it's pretty cool. I won't necessarily do a full how-to on this one, but let me show you who it was inspired by. The comments, of course, our guy John inspired this, mostly for his kids. At first, I thought it couldn't be done, but it has been done. It is now a synth. All right, so less on the how-to, but did create a GitHub just for this Pico Calc. You can read the instructions there. I may have an in-depth video if you guys get stuck or if it's just not clear at all. I did create some helper files for the original as it wasn't quite what I wanted. Had a few defects as I will call them. So we had to kind of make some fixes. But I will give credit to Zio Dante again. Um, I did give credit in the README. But if you do have any issues installing it or you just have questions, let me know. Get in the comments. I can do a full how to video and jump into some of the helper commands, such as the, uh, I think I have like a run pie, a special one. Um, along with a special little menu um, and full access to the SD card as well. So, anywho, hope you enjoyed. Get at you another time. Pico Calc is a synth. Let's go. More to come. Until next time. Peace. Four fingers this time. All right, I'm gone.